Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a fall, a huge fall haul. These, this is more of a collective haul. I have purchased these throughout the past couple of weeks, throughout the past two months. Um, whenever fall really started, let's just go ahead and get into the video. First, what I'm going to talk about is H&M. H&M is really good with the types of sales that they have. They have sales ranging from like $5, 10 $15 um, in their little sales section, which is always great. But I will be inserting pictures here um, with me put, putting these on from the pictures in my blog. So this is just a top. This is more of a dressy, flowy top. And please keep in mind that I do work full time. So most of these things I do buy for work and also for places where I can go out if I wanna go out during the weekend or just some of these things are casual and some of these things will be like not work appropriate if that makes sense. So yeah, this just has some like really nice detailing in the back. These are just buttons in the back and it has like a really nice um, floral lace in the back and the shoulders as well and then it does have like a little button here but this is kind of long on my arms so what I think I'm going to be doing is just roll up the sleeves so this is what I got from H&M like I said this didn't have like a little um, sale tag Ooh, my phone just went off. Um, this didn't have like a little sale tag, but um, I did get this for $10. This is in the size... What size is this? This is in a size 2, which um, for my type of body, I feel like H&M doesn't really like work well with my type of body just because I am... Um, I do have like a bigger chest and yes I did just grab my boobs. I do have a bigger chest so therefore like a size 2 and some things won't fit just because it, it won't go past my chest. Okay so the next thing that I got from H&M is um, this shirt right here which um, like I said H&M shirts are really like a hit or a miss and I tried this shirt on it's just a nice satin type of shirt just has like a low V cut here and then at the bottom it's like a little bit scooped here and then it has like slits as well on the sides so I thought this was really really pretty um, when I went to go try this on this was a size 2 and it would not go past down my chest so then um, I didn't have time to go try on another size but I usually am a size 4 so I bought this in, in a size 4 and when I got home it fit really tight around my chest area so this is something that I cannot wear. Next thing what I'm going to do is do what I bought at Loft. What I picked up at Loft is this beautiful, um, this is sort of like an oversized shirt with a really like long peplum at the bottom and I really like this just because um, I have a really short torso so Peplums, like regular peplum shirts, don't look well on me unless it's a um, longer peplum style like this. And I feel like I could wear this to work if I dress it up and wear dress pants just because it is flowy. It's not see-through as much, but you can get away with like wearing a black or a like um, same color bra as this. So I really like this. I believe I got this for 12 12 or 4 no I got this for $12 because um, they were having 60% off their already marked down prices so I thought that was a steal next thing what I got is this shirt and I mainly got it for work I have to turn it inside out um, I mainly got it for work just because I don't have a shirt like this and I have been wanting to like buy more work shirts it's just this really nice um, dress shirt it's very very flowy and this is actually in a size small petite and i i am a bit like I, I do have to shop for petite clothing um when of it when available because i am really short it fits per perfectly it's not tight around my chest area and i got this for this was $49.99, but 60% off of that, I believe. I forgot how much I got it for. The shirt that I just uh, showed you guys that is in a size extra small, and it does run big, which is why I got it in a size extra small and not a small or a medium width, which I usually am. Okay, next thing what I got is something that I didn't think I would ever get just because I'm not a big... Um, I, I don't shop for jewelry unless... Um, 
it's really really on sale like for $1.99 at like an, at like the store called Six at my mall but I got this because I saw it while I was waiting in line to pay and I just thought it was the most beautiful um, ne long necklace ever and I don't own any long necklaces which is why when I saw this I was like this would pair perfect with the peplum shirt that I got so I believe I got this for $14 which I was like, you know what, let me just get it, I'm just going to get it, I'm just going to do it. This is my first time splurging on like something like this, so I got it. Okay, next thing I'm going to talk about is what I bought at Banana Republic. Now, please keep in mind that I always do um, shop in the sale section just because um, I'm not about to pay full price when I couldn't find something as great and affordable in the sale section. So, Banana was having 40% off. Or I think it was 50% off of um, their clothing items. So I bought this really like thick material um, sweater dress. It just looks like this and it's actually pretty long. But the reason why I bought it was because when I tried it on, it looked really great on me. It was a, it was a little bit baggy on my shoulders. But I mean, that's something that is always going to happen with me. So this is actually in a size in, in a size large and it's not a petite size which is why it was kind of like a little bit too big but the reason why I got this was because when I wore it on I envisioned myself wearing like a black tank top on, underneath and like black Spanx and just my thigh high boots or like my um, over the knee boots with this and I, I actually tried that during my photo shoot and I really loved it. I did get this for $20 I think originally it was $60. Next, I'm going to talk about what I got at Forever 21. So um, that is where I do most of my shopping. I mostly shop at Forever 21 just because I feel like it's the most affordable um, place to shop at. So first, I got this uh, faux suede green skirt. I did wear this already and I did do a photo shoot just on this skirt and like four or five ways to style a suede skirt for the fall slash winter time and um i really like it i love this it is such a nice material it's comfy it's cozy and it stretches um and i got this in a size small and i really like it i believe i got this for around 15 dollars and then um i bought this skirt right here this is more of a um corduroy type uh, skirt it's not suede and it's not leather either this is more of a thicker material great for winter time but it does have pockets on the sides here so you can like slip your hands in and these are actual buttons they're not like the clasp bonds that the other skirt had so this one I actually tried in a size medium and it was really tight around like my stomach area so I really did not like that and then I didn't have time to try on a large, so I bought a large. This is in a size large, and honestly, I wore this once, and I did not like the way that I looked in it. And I believe I got this for $15 as well. So, next thing that I got. Um, I got this a while ago, and this is just an olive mustardy green color. This is, um, I bought this primarily just for work, just because I don't have a color like this, and... I think it's appropriate if you pair it with dress pants and then just tuck it in. So I believe I got this for seven or nine bucks when I got it when they were having a flash sale. I really like that. And that shirt is in a, in a size small. So next thing that I got is this skirt right here. I still haven't worn it. I have tried it on and I love it. I am obsessed with this skirt. Um, this is a bodycon skirt with really nice detailing it's it's thin but it's not like too thin i feel like i could pair it with some thick uh leggings or tights and it would look great especially with some booties i i already have like my outfit plan for this this i got for 9.90 but it was 50 percent off so i got it for like four something i also got this off of their website and i hate it the, these are just some chanel inspired shorts or not chanel inspired these, these, these are more like tweed shorts but it's not like the tweed material it's more on the thinner side and this was 22.90 so i got this for like 10 11 bucks and i don't like it i hate it it's just really big i think this is like part of their like contemporary um 
style so it, it run, does run big and then the last last thing that i got from forever 21 is this dress right here it is just this 33 inch um length dress with some lace detailing and it does come with like a built-in slip which um when i got this from their website it looked completely different from their from their, their website and first of all this on their website they advertised it as a mini dress which is why i got it because i am short and i can't wear like knee length dresses and on the tag it says knee length ivory dress which i was really upset so i really don't like this I'm probably going to sell it on poshmark because i did not like it and that was 24.90 so i believe i paid ten dollars for it last few things that i got from forever 21 are just socks i got these um over the the knee socks that has some like little lace de detailing at the end and when i wore this my boyfriend just said it looks like you're wearing lingerie and i was like oh i mean i was kind of going for that look but i didn't want it to look like too like out there but i really still like these these are um gray and they are thicker so i got this for i got this for 6.90 just for one pair and then i wanted some basic um over the knee socks so i got this one in this color burgundy and then i got it in a black color so i got it in burgundy and black and i got these two pairs for 6.90 which was awesome and then I also got from a different from a, a different store. So that's all for every twenty one. I got all of these remaining things from the store called De Janeiro. It is a new, I believe it's a New York City based um, store. So you can't shop online for these, unfortunately. But I did get these pair of tights. Um, I've just been obsessed with tights like these. I have I I did buy like three other pairs, like two um, opaque ones. And then, well, like one semi opaque and then one sheer black. And then I got one with like with like a strip of bows down the middle. And then I got one with the bows all around just because I'm obsessed with bows and I really like it. So I got these and these are only like $2.99 each, which I thought it was a steal because I think like at Forever 21, they're, they're like 5 or $6. So I did get them. And if they break, I don't really mind just because I did pay like... $2.99 for it so I got that and then I got this dress from their sales section so I actually got this for $2.99 this is just this type of um, bodycon dress it does fit me kind of long on on me but I ha had a feeling that I would want to wear this with um, over the knee boots so it'll look like a little bit dressed up and not like I won't look like a sausage as much so i got this this is in a size um this is in a size small so i got this for 2.99 at the store called de janeiro and i like it it's a really nice material it doesn't itch or anything because it does come with a slip underneath which is what i really like and then i got this sweater here i love this sweater this is a really nice color i just think that this color looks great on anyone that wants to wear um something like a sweater or like you know wants to wear something other than black so i really like this it has buttons here which um it's kind of a problem for me just because these sleeves are really long on my arms so i would have to like roll up the sleeves and it might look a little bit weird because of the buttons but i got this in a size large just because I'm afraid that when I put it in the dryer, it's going to shrink. And I got this for $11.99. And I really like it. And I can't wait to wear it later on. So last thing that I got from the store de Janeiro, I just got this maroon type dress shirt. It looks like this. I really like the little slit down the middle. I really like the sleeves, the way it rolls up here because it just makes it look a little bit more dressier. And it does flow at the bottom as well. And I got this in a size small. And I believe I got this for um, $10 as well. So I think it's really affordable. I really like that store. But sometimes I can't go in because I know that I can't be buying stuff like that all the time. And then I made a purchase on DSW to get some more over the knee boots. I got these types of boots 
right here. These are, I think it's called Cupid Tobin boots. Um, I got these for $40 just because I had a coupon code that would get me like 20, 10 or $20 off the original price. So I got these and I got this in a size six because they didn't carry a size five and a half, which is, a uh, which is like one of like my biggest, um, concerns or one of like the biggest things that I struggle with is because I do need a size five and a half because my feet are really tiny. So a size six, like it, it does fit loose, but I feel like when I wear with tights and like over the knee socks and like another pair of size, it fits perfectly. So that's that. And then the last thing that I want to talk about are about these chokers. This is a choker that my sister actually made. And she's been really into crocheting lately. So she has made like a ton of things like hats, scarves. Chokers is one of the things that like I requested from her. And I told her what I wanted in my choker and she actually did it. She made these little like scallopy de detailings here. And um, I'm not sure if she opened up her Etsy website yet. But if she did, I'm going to link it down below just because I want to support her business and I feel like if people are interested in these kinds of chokers I believe she's only selling them for like six or seven dollars um, and then she does um, add a little uh, room for the back in case you need to adjust the length and there is like a little button in the back where you can secure it so yeah I have this I got this in the burgundy color that she made because I requested this and then she also made me a black one as well so that completes video i really hope you guys enjoyed it i'm so sorry it was really long but this was a really long overdue haul that i needed to do for fall slash winter time so let me know what you guys think like i said um i have modeled mostly all of these outfits mostly these outfits on just under petite.com which is my website that i created it's an everything blog I really hope you guys can check it out sometime soon. I'll link it down below as well. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. And I'll see you guys next week with a brand new video. Bye, guys. Mwah.